Hello and welcome. I'm Vlad, champion athlete. I've used skills learned in my sport over the years and applied them to business and life to become just as successful. Now, a businessman, author, lecturer, coach, world traveller and of course a family man, if you allow me, I'll be sharing with you weekly tips and tricks on health and well-being for the mature of the mind and body so you can capture the bombardment of information, get to the fine print fast and get on with enjoying and embracing life worry-free. I invite you to stay connected by subscribing to this channel. Now, without further ado, let's get started with a classic one-liner as we will every week to lighten us up. Can you guess who it is this week? By this time I'll close your schools. No. I'm sorry, Mo. Oh, oh, think nothing of it. Oh, gee, thanks. Hey, you're welcome. Now that was a great classic, wasn't it? Hope you enjoyed that one. Now let's get on with uh, giving you the most best in cut through the wire, uh, get to the point, uh, stop mincing a word, stop waffling, stop posing, stop pretending, because me, like you, like everybody else, we don't have the time anymore. And I've watched a lot of videos on YouTube and people just waffle and waffle and waffle. So without further ado, as I said early on, let's get to the video, give you some great information. I promise I'll try to keep them under five minutes. I'm sure you got five minutes to spare. So here we go with today's topic. The Cox itself, it's only a 17 horsepower and a 32 inch cut. But the advantages of this outweigh the fact that it's a smaller engine. It is more compact. Eight litres will last you about five hours of hard, heavy duty work. It hasn't got as many moving parts. You've only got the brake on this side and a foot brake as well. It's a hand brake, foot brake. You've got your acceleration there and you've got your tray engagement lever as well and the height of the tray. That's about it. You start by placing your foot on the start button and it is a heel toe accelerator, heel toe, heel toe. There's no changing gears, there's no placing it back and forth and so on. If you need to get your battery for any other parts, it's quite easily done by just unclipping these two clips and you're there. You get to any part you want, any of the filters, anything you need, you're there at the fingertips. Quite easily done. The other thing is the tray itself is much more easy and accessible to get to and it only has one, has one um, belt, tray belt, which is very very easy to get to, shouldn't fall off. Okay, so advantage of that and of course not as much dirt here as it was in the other one. The other thing is you need to get to your other belt, it's just in there. So if it falls off, you can quite easily fix it. Now, the beauty of this machine, it's done 150 hours as opposed to 55 on the other one, is that I paid twice as much for this one as I did for that one. And guess what? This machine, easy to maintain, easy to do your own service, easy to get to. The blades themselves, there's only four, and you can actually change it like a normal lawn mower as opposed to this one here where you have to remove the whole underneath tray. Here, you just grab it, grab the blade, open up this flap here, and there you are. You can just replace them from underneath, just from here, like you would do a normal lawn mower. So the advantages of this, I recommend the Cox to anyone, Australian company. Easier, less moving parts. Yes, it costs a little bit more, but there's always a saying, he who pays more, pays less in the wrong, long run. So go your own minds, as far as I'm concerned, Coxie is a winner Good for one, me. Mate. By the way, if you want any of the free information that I have or any PDF books that I might have, just drop me a line, let me know, and I'll give you the links and I'll even email it to you. So if you want them, ask for them. Cheers for now. Be afraid.